We're building the wall. People don't understand that. They're starting to learn. We're spending uh, a lot of money that we have on hand. It's like in a business, but we have money on hand and we're building. I would say we will have 115 miles of wall, maybe a little bit more than that very shortly. Uh, it's being built. Some of it's already been completed. And in San Diego, if you look, it's been completed. It's really beautiful, brand new. Uh, we have other wall that's under construction, and we're giving out a lot of contracts. So we're building the wall. It's getting built one way or the other. Is, it, is there another option besides the National Emergency? Uh, we, are, we are doing things right now. I mean, we're building it with funds that are on hand. Uh, we're negotiating very tough prices. We've designed a much better-looking wall that is also actually a better wall, which is an interesting combination. It's far more beautiful, and it's better. It's much more protective. Uh, but it looks better, because the walls that they used to build were not very attractive. I actually think that's possibly part of the problem. But the real problem is we need something. We have to have a very strong barrier. But we're building a lot of wall right now as we speak, and we're renovating a lot of wall. And uh, we're getting ready to give out some very big contracts with money that we have on hand and money that comes in. But we will be looking at a national emergency, because I don't think anything's going to happen. I think the Democrats don't want border security. And when I hear them talking about the fact that walls are immoral and walls don't work, uh, they know they work. I watched somebody being interviewed the other day by a very good anchor. And the anchor actually was getting angrier and angrier as they tried to explain how a wall doesn't really have that much of an impact, and yet thousands of people are on one side of the wall and nobody's on the other side of the wall. Uh, it was actually laughable and really uh, horrible in, in the same breath. So uh, that's the way it is. You know, if you look at El Paso, if you look at certain places, but El Paso was one of the most dangerous cities in the whole country. Once the wall was completed, it became one of the safest immediately. It wasn't like it took five years. Some of you know this. Immediately, it became one of the safest cities in the whole country. So uh, we're building the wall. A lot of it is, I mean, the chant now should be finish the wall as opposed to build the wall, because we're building a lot of wall. And I started this six months ago. We really started going to town, because I could see we're getting nowhere with the Democrats. We're not going to get anywhere with them. It's going to be a part of their campaign, but I don't think it's good politically. And I think Nancy Pelosi should be ashamed of herself because she's hurting a lot of people. I think the Democrats should be ashamed of themselves. Now, in all fairness to the Democrats, many of them want the wall. And I see it. They're just dying to say what they want to say. But they can't say it as, as well as they would be able to if they were allowed to do it. Yes? Mr. President, uh, so are you saying now you believe that on February the 15th, the only option you will have left is either close down the government or yeah. declare an emergency because you don't have any faith that this committee will come up with an answer. And if you do declare an emergency, are you concerned that you will almost be immediately and be enjoined by some court in the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals District? Well, we have very, very strong legal standing. It would be very hard to do that. Uh, but uh, they tend to go to the Ninth Circuit. And when they go to the Ninth Circuit, things happen. For instance, uh, the ban. It missed, and then missed, and then was approved in the United States Supreme Court, where we have had a very good record. Uh, they go to the Ninth Circuit in many cases, and in fact, in most cases, it has nothing to do with the Ninth Circuit. It's a shame uh, what they do. So let's see what happens. I can only tell you this, John. We have very, very strong legal standing to win. Uh, we are doing it regardless. I mean, we don't have — we haven't declared the national emergency yet, and what, yet we're building a lot of wall. We're continuing to build a lot of wall with, as we would say in business, cash on hand. And we're negotiating tough prices. We have a great system, a great wall system. It's very uniform. They used to have all these different systems. Nobody knew what was going on. We have a very good, solid system that looks good and is very powerful as a wall. But are you saying now you expect to declare a national I, I don't want to say, but you'll hear the State of the Union, and then you'll see what happens right after the State of the Union, okay?